What's going on YouTube? This is Gadang775. I'm here with another video. And this video is a little continuation of the last video about the Nintendo NX hybrid console. So today I was browsing Google, skimming through the internet, I mean, and I typed in, you know, I kept on doing searches about relevant video game articles about this hybrid console. Lo and behold, article from Game Nisha caught my eye. Yeah, I give me I've never heard of them. But other than that, um Liam Robertson of Unseen 64 interviewed a Nintendo employee and he was quoted saying that the Nintendo NX does not need to be as powerful as the PS4. Mind is blown. Do you know why my mind is blown? Because of the stupidity of some people. I mean if there is any truth to this rumor that the Nintendo NX is not going to be as powerful as the PS4, they are going to totally epic fail and bomb. I guarantee they will. They need to get on the ball. I mean, look at their last system, the Wii U. What an epic failure. I mean, this is the most epic failure of failures if they release a system. That is not as powerful as the PS4. Look, they need to future proof these systems. Okay? If they release this system sometime next year with, you know, specs that are not as powerful as the PS4, I don't think they're going to do well. I think it's done. They're done. For, they're done. I mean,. If they release this system in 2017 with specs not as powerful as the PS4, it's a guaranteed they're done. They're going to so get crushed. Because come 2017, two or three years after that, Microsoft and Sony will release their ninth gen consoles. I mean, this is totally bad news for if you're a Nintendo fan. It's bad news. I'm a Nintendo fan. They haven't given me a reason to buy a Nintendo in a while. The only Nintendo that I own is this, my little 3DS XL, which I love. Kind of pissed me off, too, about that. I mean, you need to buy the new Nintendo 3DS XL to play Xenoblade. Yeah, that was the dumbest fucking thing I've ever seen. So I went ahead and traded in my old 3DS to get a new 3DS XL. Oh, well, sorry. I went off topic a little bit there. But I'll save that rant for another day. Other than that, Nintendo needs to get on the ball. They need to get their heads out of their asses, out of the 80s, and into the 2000s. Because this is not acceptable. This system needs to be more powerful than the PS4 and the Xbox One. Okay, They need industry-leading chipsets, industry-leading hardware in their systems. They need to future-proof the system for the next year or two after it rolls out for them to even be relevant when Microsoft and Sony release their new systems after the Xbox One and PS4. They also need to make the system powerful so they appeal to third-party publishers like EA, Activision, whatnot, because they can't do it alone with their first-party exclusives. Nintendo already has a bunch of first-party exclusives that people want to play. Now they just need support from third party publishers basically stay in the business. They need their Call of Duties, Assassin's Creed, they need their Far Cries, they need their Triple A exclusives. There's no Fallout on the Wii U. Come on guys, get on the ball. If you get third party support mixed in with your awesome first party lineup and you guys have industry leading hardware chipsets, you guys are gonna do fine. If you don't buy Nintendo, you're gonna fail. Just like the Wii U did. This is Gadang775. You like this video? Go ahead, hit like and subscribe for every for videos every few days. Peace out.